Rutgers MSE department, Materials Science and Engineering. We're one of the oldest departments, one of the oldest centers of research and education, dating back to 1902, uh, when we initially were founded as a school of ceramics. Uh, but in the last 10 to 15 years, we've grown into a large uh, department of material science and engineering, uh, researching all important areas of modern materials. Then when you uh, turn the light off and on really easily, you can see the jump in the current. So a major research focus in the material science and engineering department at Rutgers University is low dimensional materials, uh, and in particular 2D materials. So these two dimensional materials have exotic condensed matter uh, effects and phenomena that, that can be exploited for novel electronic optical devices. So you, you transfer the MOS to as we know, silicon electronics will come to an end in not so distant future. And two-dimensional materials have been thought to be viable candidates for replacing silicon. In addition to catalytic properties, we're also investigating the electrochemical storage properties of two-dimensional materials. This department is known for its patents, its innovation. We develop technology, we take it through to the point where it can be used by industry. Here at Rutgers Material Science and Engineering, we're developing a, a wide range of fabrication methods for large scale and large volume synthesis of plasmonic nanostructures with very controlled size and shape. And the reason we want to do that is because for practical applications of plasmonics in portable optoelectronic devices, we need large volumes of metal nanostructures uh, to be fabricated in a very short time and at low cost. We also have some excellent characterization facilities such as ultra high resolution transmission electron microscopy and so that we can actually image surface plasmons propagating on a single nanoparticle. And so this is demonstrating a one angstrom spot here for this material. At the graduate level, uh, we have about 75 graduate students, mostly at the PhD level, and it's a very rich graduate environment, uh, and indeed employers and other universities eagerly seek out our graduates. I really like the diversity of the MSc program here at Rutgers. I enjoy the diversity in the professors and the students from different countries, from different places, from different education backgrounds and that gave me the opportunity to collaborate within the department and also with other departments in the university as well. Our undergraduate student experience is very special and we teach them the things that you can't learn in textbooks. How do you design? How do you incorporate ethics in current events? How do you make a presentation? All of these things that you need to know to be successful in your career. So can we move a needle onto the electrode? Yes. And we do that through one-on-one -on -one faculty contact yeah. with students. I've gotten a wealth of experience from the material science and engineering program at Rutgers that I don't think I could have gotten anywhere else. I've had the unique opportunity to work uh, very closely with a professor uh, on research and to really apply what I learn in the classroom to what I do in the lab and therefore to apply it to real life. We research, we develop, we characterize, we process, we fabricate. And in this environment that's rich in research, space, faculty, the students feel this is going to be an outstanding education, and it is.